Hey what's up everyone this is Ray from iPhoneRepair.com and this is just a quick video tutorial because I've seen this question floating around out there a lot on YouTube and on a lot of forums uh, and I've even had it a couple of people post on my site uh, the same question and the question is um, in regards to using Total Commander now there's a lot of different uh, FTP protocols that you can use for your iPhone and uh, basically allows you to you know to go into your iPhone uh, either via Wi-Fi or USB and transfer files to and from your iPhone. Um, Win C uh, Win SCP is a real good one. Uh, I believe Cyberduck is another one. There's uh, several different ones, but the problem is most of them are for Wi-Fi, which is okay. But the problem is that Wi-Fi the transfer speeds can be a little bit slow depending on your Wi-Fi connection, the type of router you have, network traffic, yada yada. It can be slow. So the best way to do it is with uh, your USB cable. Now, uh, there's already a lot of several uh, videos floating around out there telling you how to get Total Commander, and how to install it, and all that good stuff, which is great. The problem is, is that with all these new unlocks, or excuse me, pardon me, jailbreaks that are coming out, um, a lot of them are different, and the way they do it are different. And so, when you go into Total Commander, you're not able to view all your folders. And I'm going to show you as an example. I have an iPhone 4 and it is uh, on 4.1 with baseband 01.59.00 so it is unlockable um, and I recently jailbroke it with uh, LimeRay. So I went to go to try to transfer some files, some uh, files from my computer to my device and I couldn't find the directory. So I was like okay no freak out, I've seen this before, I know what to do. Fortunately a lot of people out there don't know what to do so let me show you. So here's total commander as you can see it hopefully and this is probably what you guys see notice there's no var no private all the good stuff it's gone right okay well we'll close out of that and I'm not gonna get all technical into this I really can if I wanted to but I won't I won't bore you with that I know you guys just want a solution so here's a way to fix it and let me show you my uh, iPhone real quick alright so here's my iPhone go into Cydia and give that a moment to load which Cydia does seem to be loading a lot faster these days which is definitely an improvement uh, from before they joined Rock so looks like there's been some good improvements now that Cydia and Rock have joined joined up so that's good news anyways what you want to do is you want to go search tap on the search and what you want to search for is for AFC to add Give that a moment to load. All right, and here you'll see it. Package to add AFC to service for USB browsing on the file system. So basically, what it is is kind of like what I said. The different type of jailbreaks, uh, the way they're done, are different. Uh, before some of them, as soon as you did the jailbreak, you'd be able to use Total Commander and you'd be able to see all your folders. Well, with the newest one with Lime Rain, I haven't um, used Green Poison uh, personally, but with Lime Rain, it's the same thing. You can't view the folders. So, all you do is install this. Now, I've already had this installed previously, so it installs the uh, this package and it also installs Erica Utilities. Uh, so you'll see another one when you download when you download it. Alright, and now my device is going to have to reboot, so you're going to lose it on the screen for a second because it's going to reboot. Okay, so my iPhone is rebooted. Um, I'll go ahead and show you that real quick.
there you go iPhones rebooted and now I will go into Total Commander press the one button and what do you see there you go there's your var you can go into your stash go into your themes you can see all your themes so there we go like I said pretty simple pretty basic uh, nothing really special to it uh, if you really want to know more how it works if you want me to bore you to death with that I'm happy to let you know or tell you or explain it to you in tech terms if not if you're just wanting to know how to fix this problem just go to Cydia search for that application install it to your device it doesn't put any active icon in your device it's nothing that you see on your actual screen it just installs it uh, to your iPhone directly but doesn't show any files so install that run your total commander and you should be good to go this is Ray from iPhone Repair. Thank you very much.